so this is the you can see it on the top pulley there So we pulled the uh, large sprocket off and then you can see that there's quite a bit of grime around this this edge here. So you can see there's a lot of velvety sort of buildup and then down in the well too the snap ring is almost completely obscured in these fine little shavings of something. And then you can see the shaft wobbling. This back bearing here is not completely frozen up. You can see the inner race turning within the bearing, but then at sometimes the outer race is also turning. I don't know if that shows up. So the bearing is spinning down inside the well. Not all the time, but at least some of the time. And that may be where some of this velvety debris is coming from. It could be from the outside of that that bearing where it's been kind of grinding away at the well that it sits within. So we'll have to get that snap ring out of there and pull that out to really inspect it and see what's going on down inside there. Of course this other side we haven't taken the prop flange off so we don't know what's going on down in there yet. So this is looking down inside the, the large pulley and you can see these grooves have been worn where the outer race has been spinning inside the pulley and that's what all that pasty black residue was was ground up bits of of aluminum that were stripped out of the pulley and it almost looks like these were machined to match them but it is simply the the spinning of that outer race you can see each of the four spots and the pulleys or the bearings themselves um, show very little degradation there's the seals are all intact one of them is is obviously bad, the other three are potentially not as bad.